Today, we're gonna talk about Corpse Husband. If you don't know who Corpse is, who are you and what are you doing with your life? No, I'm just playing. <laughs> I love you guys. Hi, my name's Hardy. What's up? Hello everybody, my name is Heidi McSmarty and welcome back to my channel. The only place where you can pay a low fee of $0.00 to receive my love and thankfulness. Oh, and before we get into it, I think it's important to mention that we're literally at 14.9k. That's insane. Anyway, to celebrate 15k, I want to do something. I'm not quite sure yet, but either way, I want to do a prize draw of sorts. So feel free to comment what kind of prize you guys want. Anyway, back to the video. Corpse Husband is a creator and musician who has recently gained a large following of over 7.12 million followers within the past few months. He's a pretty hot topic right now, no gothic puns intended, and has been trending multiple times. Once for literally posting a photo of his hand, uploading a voice memo on a tweet of him breathing, and was trending just the other day for troll purposes, which I'll discuss more of later. However, first I'd like to talk about his face reveal situation. There have been lots of videos going around claiming to have Corpse's face in it. Corpse is a faceless creator, similar to Dream, or other content creators who have kept their identity and face hidden from the audience. I personally believe there's nothing wrong with keeping your face hidden, and it's a way to uphold your privacy, which is completely fine. And the issue now is that people want him to reveal his face. Corpse has discussed his issues with mental illness, including the anxiety disorder known as agoraphobia, which is described as an extreme fear of open or crowded places or leaving one's home, as well as various other disorders such as fibromyalgia, TOS, and GERD. These various illnesses also affect his voice as well, which result in it being so deep. Speaking of voice, again for the people who aren't familiar with Corpse, I definitely recommend his music. You can find him on Spotify, YouTube, iTunes I believe? Yeah, iTunes has them too. Wow. White tea and cat girls are ruining my life for forever bops that live in my mind rent free. Anyway, if you're not into his music or tirade in general, yes that is what it's considered, it's, it's tirade. <laughs> I would suggest you watch some of his Among Us streams, if that's something you're into. Back on track, Corpse gained popularity through the release of E-Girls Are Ruining My Life, a song that now has over 90 million listens on Spotify, and Agoraphobic, a song he published on YouTube and recently was uploaded to Spotify. And I uh, like that one too, it's a good song. Before Corpse really gained fame, he had been reading and narrating horror stories here on YouTube. I believe he had about a uh, hundred and some thousand at the time, I think. The more people heard his music, and especially his voice, his following began to skyrocket. He's frequently trending or in the media, and a big story going on right now is the fact that, as I've mentioned, people want him to reveal his face and are fascinated with the idea of what he looks like. Now, if you've been listening, I said Corpse has an anxiety disorder, which has to do with him potentially being anxious of his privacy. Again, take this with a grain of salt. I can't explain his half, but I'm going simply off what I know. <laughs> Showing his face could cause him a large deal of anxiety and possibly backlash depending on how fans take it. It's also important to remember that he blew up. He didn't have time to grow with his audience, so it would be a lot to discuss his personal being to millions of people that he hadn't been prepared for. He's already discussing his appearance slightly, and that should be all. He has the right to his privacy and to keep his identity private. I believe people need to respect that and remember that this is a creator and a human being. <laughs> on February the 2nd, which was yesterday currently, Chris is trying on Twitter with hashtag corporate husband allegations where people posted memes that were harmless as well as a bit over the top. Now this is a tasteless trend, however some fans are genuinely upset and were confused that Corpse had actually said some racist and distasteful things, which I'm sure most people would argue he has not or would never say, so <laughs> again these are trolls and intended to be completely satire, I don't know, but um, that's all I really have to say about it. This isn't exactly a Corpse drama thing, but I'm personally annoyed at this and I think it's important to talk about it. I feel like with the attention Corpse has gotten, plenty of guys are trying to make their voice sound deeper because they think girls like them because of his low voice. And it's important to recognize that Corpse's voice is not really a great thing to have. It's a result of various mental illnesses. He's mentioned the struggles it brings on streams and how exhausting it can be for him to talk for long periods of time. And that he feels bad that he can't record and do all that more because of the possibility that his voice might just give out one day. Sure, people find low voices attractive, but to males or masculine beings watching in this video, please know that it's important to be yourself and be unique and that is what people will find attractive in you. Speaking of advice, I'd like to post a heart to heart video soon, so as always the form to submit Q&A questions will be in my description. Be sure to send something there, I'm officially switching to a Q&A based series because I don't want it to be confused and that we'll be looking for professional advice that I, uh, I don't have. I'll try to answer any question I'm given, but please keep it general and of course interesting, you know. I like the idea of uploading for Wednesdays, I don't believe I'm home next 
next week, but you know, we're gonna try as best we can. <laughs> Thank you guys all so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to check out. Thank you guys all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure to leave a like and comment about what you guys thought about this topic. Your support helps so much and I'm very grateful for it. I'll hopefully get something out about the 15k giveaway soon. If you're interested in that, be sure to keep an eye out and updates from my community tab. Either way, I think that's all for me today. Thank you guys all so much for watching. I love you all so much and I'll see you in the next one.